Hello and welcome to the 11 o'clock news from Bahrain International. I'm Heba Abdul Ghaffar. Bahrain Authority for Culture and Antiquities has officially ushered the 2018 edition of the Bahrain Summer Festival and BACA President Sheikha Maya bint Muhammad Al Khalifa opened Nakhul Tent. More on this report with Yasmir Ibrahim. The Bahrain Authority for Culture and Antiquities has officially launched the much-awaited 10th edition of the Bahrain Summer Festival at a special event at Nakhul Tent near the Arad Fort, which combined both the Bahraini and Arab heritage in the presence of diplomats, cultural and media figures, as well as families. Today is the opening of the Bahrain Summer Festival. This festival has been with us for the past 10 years. It's an exciting time for families and children to come and to be entertained throughout the summer months. Of course, this year we are in Arad. We are celebrating Muharraq as capital of Islamic culture. And under that umbrella, we have created this wonderful space that hosted so many of our events. Of course, this year the Bahrain Summer Festival will be hosting uh, activities for all ages of children. It's a great place for families to come and to enjoy. Um, the educational activities are equally as important as the other fun activities. I encourage everyone to come and visit us here at Nakhul Tent. We've had a, we've had a, a lovely impromptu concert uh, today with some, some excellent uh, young, young musicians, particularly Bahraini young musicians. Both uh, oud players and drummers have really stood out today. But what really excites me is the range of activities that are going on here. I would say it's even even more vibrant than last year. Uh, and there's so much for, uh, for, for the children to do uh, and for parents to know that, that the, the, the range of activities changes right through the summer. So it's worth coming back again and again. The Nakhul Tent offers young talents from the ages of three and up a rich and varied schedule of daily activities, workshops and events to learn and enhance their skills in a broad range of fields in a fun, family-friendly atmosphere, including music, reading, arts and crafts, filmmaking and electronics. Well, it was wonderful to be here today for the, the opening of the Summer Festival. It's always a wonderful time. And it's great to see all the different activities that are here. And it's great to really see um, our partners who we've worked with over the years, the Authority for Culture and Antiquities. Um, they put on a great festival, and this year is no exception. Um, during the summer, a lot of kids don't have anything to do, and they find themselves um, troubled with the fact that they don't have work anymore or they, they don't see their friends anymore. So this festival allows both kids and adults to enjoy their summer and enjoy their free time in a way that's both um, healthy and educational for both the parents and the children. The two-month-long festival, organized by the Bahrain Authority for Culture and Antiquities, comes in line with the Authority's dedication to celebrate Mahara, capital of Islamic culture, and highlights the island's position as a preferred regional cultural tourism destination. Reporting for Bahrain International, I'm Yasmin Ibrahim.